Good evening, folks. And today, I got to tell you one thing. Well, some people keep asking me this, and constantly. Strange, my friends know this. Most of my friends know this, but others don't. But others probably wouldn't probably figure this out. Is there a Mrs. in the future? Yes, there is. There is a Mrs. in the future. There is a Mrs. in the future. They keep asking me that all the time. But that's not what this is about. You treat your other half... Rather, if it's a Mr. or a Mrs., with respect. It's all about respect. Rather, it's the same party, the opposite party. I saw this a while back ago. It really caught my eyes and kind of made me cry almost. It went on last year. The parents were diehard liberals. And they're actually, this is an Ohio family, actually. I literally almost cried. The family is from Ohio. The mother and the daughter is conservative and she was going to marry a diehard conservative boyfriend, soon to be husband actually, I should say that. (laughs) Excuse me. I'm not real good at wording things, so I apologize for that. So they get, she's marrying him. So when it happens, they will not attend the wedding because they're diehard liberals. They did not want to see their daughter marry a conservative. But she... So what is... They give... She gives them an ultimatum. She says... Her parents are kind of like... Well, it's either us or him. That was their ultimatum. And she says... I'm picking me. And me... Is going with... Him. I'm going with my husband. With my husband-to-be. And sure enough... They don't want anything to do with him, with her and him now. Even though if they get grand, even though they get grandchildren, I don't know what happened or anything. They don't want anything to do with them because they're diehard liberal. They don't believe anything that a conservative view is compared to them. Yeah. There are, there are bumps in the road along the way when you have loved ones. But it's not like we got to stop what we're doing and say, hey, we don't agree with you and just break away and stop the relationship because we disagree with you. That's not how that works. Don't break a relationship with your loved one or loved ones, for that matter, because of that. That there is just pure sad. I mean... I'm a fan of Mark May, Mark Maine show. I mean, this is where I heard it from. I mean, he really made sense of how it was. He he made lots of sense of the way it all put it out there. He literally he literally put it all the way together. He told them how it was. He said literally what it was. But if you're gonna have, but you shouldn't. It you cannot have parties separate each other keep politics out of your lives that's all i gotta say keep politics out of relationships and i really do mean that and yes there will be a missus in my life someday i don't know when but sometime down the road there will be a missus in my life with that being said i gotta get out here and you'll see her on wednesday I'm going to to make sure you see her. You'll get to meet her. And with that being said, peace.